What's up, guys? This is Kyle from Wax Museum, and I am back from the Nationals, so I got a big stack of cards and a big stack of mail that I eventually want to get to, so I um, figured I'd make this first video here. This is a lot that I bought, and I'll start opening it while I kind of run through uh, what little I know about it. it it's um, 800 football and basketball cards, and... Um, it cost me about $120 shipped, and I bought it because of two pictures, even though I know there's quite a bit of junk in it. I saw an Iverson New Edition, which I think, on a conservative estimate, is about a $60 card. And then the last picture was just a huge stack of pages, like this big, and they had a ruler next to it. So, um, you know, I could end up losing 60 bucks on this lot. Um, in theory, with the, you know, the Iverson being the only hit, who knows, but um, I thought it was worth the risk. I thought it was something that I should go ahead and look at, and I thought it'd be fun to open on the channel, too. So we're hoping that our luck continues. We've had some pretty good luck lately, um, which that's, you know, at some point will come to an end, but um, and we don't want to take too many risks. But, um, I thought this would be a fun one. So, alright. So let's see. Actually, there's a pretty cool card on the first page. I don't know a lot about baseball, and it looks like it's Carl Crawford, maybe. Alright, so let's just dig in. I'll try and get as much of this on camera as I possibly can. Uh, let me make sure I am zoomed all the way out, which I am. Alright, so let's, so I don't think these Dodgers... Cards are worth a whole lot. Um, I don't think this Carl Crawford is worth a whole lot either, although I'll be honest, I don't know that set. Um, oh, it's not even Carl Crawford. I'm sorry. That's Alfonso Soriano. I could read that. If I could actually read, I would see that. That's Alfonso Soriano. So uh, at least it's a Yankee. There is some damage on the bottom. Like I said, I don't think it's worth much. Uh, there's a Jalen Rose base card, so we do know there's some basketball in here, a Garnett base card, and we've got second coming. Um, so there's Iverson, there's some other people on here, so um, there are a lot of cards in here, so I'll try and go a little bit quicker with this, and I'll have to consult some of my baseball people for these. Judging by how many there are, I'm going to guess they're not really worth anything, um, although I can always move Griffey stuff, even if it's just dollar stuff, Griffey stuff moves easily. So, and then more second coming cards, um, that would be post Jordan. So I, you know, I'm looking for like Kobe there. I don't see him. Let me turn these. So these will be quick cause that's junk football, junk football. I'm, I don't, what am I looking for in there? Maybe is that the far rookie year? I don't know. That's not my, not my forte. Um, all right, so let's take a look here. This is a skybox. It's part of the, the base set. Um, so nothing, you know, too crazy there. There's Shaq, Future Shock. At least nothing crazy that I know of. Okay. Um, Jordan Hologram there, not worth a lot, but still a cool card to have. I think these are still about five bucks. Um, and that's kind of scratched up, but if nothing else, that's a cool card for the PC if I, uh, if it's not really worth selling. So, okay, um, you know, nothing real nice in these. I know these, I'm not going to spend a lot of time with those. Trying not to bore you with all of that. It's a lot of this set. All right, there's a, one of the Shaq rookies. Looks kind of roughed up. Corners. Roughed up, not great. Probably be dollar box material. All right, nothing great there. Nothing great there. What do we have? If maybe in these we have who would be the rookie that year? Penny. We got Vin. Oh no, this is later. No, 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 this is later. Um, Antonio Davis, Sam Cassell, Nick Van Exel, Lindsey Hunter. Kuko, oh, Kukoc, yeah, so it would be 93, 94, that's what I thought. 
Dino Raja, so that's Hall of Fame rookie card, which is, I still can't wrap my head around that. Um, all right, now I'm going to spend a lot of time with these. So like I said, there was an Iverson new edition, um, which makes me think like there's got to be some better stuff that we're coming up on. Here's a nice looking Garnett gold label. Nice looking card, clean card. That um, will sell for something. Put this back in here. Vince Carter. No, another Garnett. Why did I think that was Vince Carter? I don't know what else on the back of these, but a Garnett. Good stuff. Insert. What do we got here for baseball? Barry Bonds. Chris Benson. I remember him and his wife. Uh, Bernie Williams. All right, so what all we got down here? I don't know the holographics as well. Um, I don't, I mean, I think I would be looking for the the awesome, um, which I don't think I have. That's a great looking card though. So I like that, I'll pull that out. This Duncan is pretty common. Um, cool looking card though. Okay, so I like that. Um, there's a Reggie Miller refractor. I like that. There we go. <laughs> That's actually pretty nice. That's a nice PC find in there. I didn't know that was going to be in there. Um, and then some nice, so here's, this is some decent stuff here. This, unfortunately, I got to get it from the other side of the page, but we got Shaq and AI gold label. We've got some, looks like some AI base on the back of Chris Benson, uh, Grant Hill, Iverson. So at least, um, you know, if the new edition is the only other one in here, only other real card of substance, we got some other little stuff. Oh, okay. Well, here's a whole page of Jordan. So that always helps. I'm not going to take all those out. I'll just put the page aside. Here's another page of Jordan. So I can live with that. Pretty cool. Try and get, you know, I'll have to make sure there's nothing crazy in there. Try and get a dollar a piece for the Jordans if possible. Although that's getting harder again. It was doable for a while. Getting a little harder. Um, and then we've got these these rewind cards of Tim Duncan. So I'll put that page, that whole page aside. More Jordan. Put that page aside. Okay, I'm happy with the Jordans. A couple more Jordans. We got AI. What do we got here? Vince Carter. Some Vince Carter stuff, some Jordan stuff. Masters of the Hardwood. Scotty Pippen. Masters of the Hardwood, Scotty Pippen. All right, look at that uh, embossing. That's pretty cool. I'll put that aside. What are these, bazooka stickers would be my guess. Is it 03, 04 bazooka? No, these are from, oh, these are Skybox tattoos. Okay, bazooka did the tattoos as well. I guess we're not into the 2000s cards yet. I got a Pacers tattoo. <laughs> I will probably not be wearing that nice um nice to get a pacer though here we got some impact base see a star quest oh okay star quest uh jordan i can live with that actually i'm just going to put this whole page aside star quest jordan we got a garnet finest garnet finest all right that was a good page huh I did not see all, ooh, I see some other good stuff coming here. Some more Jordans. So this is, um, I didn't see all this stuff in the preview, so I like what we're getting to. There's Jordans on this page. And I'll have to check through for international variants too, which quite honestly is a pain, checking for that stuff. Some Iverson uh, rookies, Marbury rookie down there. 
I know not all these are Iverson rookies, but we got a couple here and a couple here. Um, so that's cool. That's a good page. Got some more Jordan. That is a, a little dinged up, but it's a Topps Gold. Can't go wrong with Jordan. That's a starting lineup, Jordan. Cool. Okay, some more Jordan here. Uh, it's just low in stuff. And a Garnett rookie. Huh. So that's a nice page. Looks like we got some Space Jam stuff coming up. Some Space Jam Jordans, which those are, I suppose those are relevant now. We got Jam Session Jordan. Um, this, I'm guessing, is a team sheet, the perforated version. All right. <laughs> I don't even know what I got coming up here after this page. I'll... All right, let's see what we got here. Nothing that sticks out here. Uh, I can live with a couple Jordan medals on the back. That'd be 96. So that's nice. I'll put that page aside. What do we got here? All right, so this is the General Sherman Junior High School Basketball Award presented to Brian Covell for his performance both on and off the court, February of 1999. Congratulations, Brian. Uh, you deserved it. <laughs> and on the back here, we've got a uh, Jordan limited print run, 13,800 out of 40,000. We'll leave that with Brian's certificate for right now. Limited run. It's only 40,000 made. All right. Next page. These are upside down. Let me flip all these. All right. So we got some Pippin stuff, but nothing that I can see of real substance there. Some more Pippin stuff. Just glossing over it quick. Nothing. Looks like nothing of substance. We've got... Okay, what do we got here? A Darvin Ham rookie. That actually feels thick, like there's a lot of cards in there. Um, let's see what we got here. A Willie Mays, Kellogg's, and Hank Aaron. I don't think these are worth a lot, but these are pretty cool. Might just keep those lenticular cards. That's cool. Anything Kellogg's, I usually just assume is mass printed. Uh, mass printed. There we go. Can't talk. Stackhouse. Let me see what else we got here. And was that one of the 3D cards? Marvin Harrison, rookie. I was just talking about him yesterday with somebody at the National. Marvin Harrison is innocent. There was some Marvin Harrison slander going on. That will not be tolerated. He only owned the firearm. These feel like they might be stuck together with like a little bit of moisture. So we got some 97 Fleer Ultra NASCAR. Um, I bet these were in like a food product with the way that they're wrapped. Shoney's. Yeah, they're Shoney's cards. We've got a Vinny Testaverde card. We've got... A Michael Jordan Valentine, which those probably have their run like everything else. Set that aside. Ugh. I don't like the I don't like that sound. Alright. Oh that's Star Date looks pretty cool. If I can even extract it from there. This is when we might just have to leave it in there for now and just be careful. But yeah. That looks pretty cool. I will put that aside. Nice acetate Stackhouse's scrapbook as well. These, nothing is ugh, gross. I don't, I don't know what uh, is holding all these together. I really don't want to speculate. <laughs> all right, let's see. I see some die cut. I see some Duncan. On the back of this page, we got Biggio, Lieberthal, Green, Kevin Brown. Nothing I'm too excited about on the baseball side. Rim Rockers is a nice looking insert. Nice looking die cut. Really cool card. 
we've got Rookie re Rewind, um, View to a Thrill, Scotty Pippen. And I am not um, a 90s expert, so I'm always asking guys like Jake Roy for their expertise. So I could be missing some stuff. Um, I do my best, though, to try and learn and, and get what I can. I don't see anything that sticks out on this page. And I always have viewers that will tell me if I missed anything, too. So thank you to all of you the loyal viewers out there that um, that do kind of watch out for me. There's a gold version of it. You crash the game. But it's Joe Smith. All right, here's an Iverson. Uh, rookie. What else do we have here? Some more baseball guys. And who is this? That's an Iverson. Some more Iverson that's a rookie, that's a rookie, that's a rookie, that's a rookie. Um, then the Reebok cards, which are not super valuable, but that's cool. Iverson Starquest Blue, which is the basic level. Marbury, another Marbury rookie. Um, Steve Smith insert at the top. Gunslingers, I don't know football well. I mean, I know Elway is good, but that doesn't mean anything. What do we got here with the finest? We've got Shaq, and there's not a refractor, and Rodman, if we can even get these out of here, and that is also not a refractor, nope, but nice cards, We've got Jason Kidd rookie, so that was a that was a pretty nice page. There's some good stuff in here. Baseball, I'm not going to go through all these. Oh, geez. Uh, okay. <laughs> here we go. Kobe, metal rookie. And it's pretty clean. There's some gunk on it there. Oh, it, it's pretty clean. corner on the back. It's got a little wear. Thank you, Brian, for your Kobe rookie. Um, Duncan insert. We got Shaq Bowman's best. Finley SBX, Shaq Z Force, Rodman metal card. That was a nice page. Oh, man. Got some more gold label. Okay, so we got Marbury. Let me take this out. I'm probably going to cut we got a Marbury. Those are clean, too. We got Doug, I'm not taking Doug Christie out right now. We got Randy Brown down there. And then we got some Bowman Chrome. We got Carl Malone. Not my favorite dude in the world. Okay. Let's see what we have here. Some nice Vince Carter stuff. Mission accomplished. Got a black diamond die cut for Tim Hardaway. An Evan Eschmeyer rookie. I can retire. I don't know that holographic stuff very well. Let's see what we got here. Visionaries, Paul Pierce insert, True Colors, Carl Malone insert. Nothing that sticks out to me. There's some later metal cards. I believe these are 99. Because, uh, well, yeah, it is 99 because that's our test rookie year. Um, get some base cards of Garnett, Kobe, AI, Jordan. It's like a Ray Allen Tops rookie. Duncan insert Ray Allen. Another Ray Allen. A couple of few Ray Allen rookies on here. Put those aside. Okay. Um, nothing that sticks out there. And nothing that sticks out to me there. Got a second year Garnett tops base. I think we finally moved past the second year phenomenon. Um, Reggie Miller. Let me see if this, make sure this is not the, what, the Matrix? That would I be, yeah, it's definitely not. What else do we got here? We got a Grant Hill, Star Quest. And some Marbury stuff, Wilkins, Jerry Stackhouse. 
Okay, we've got some Kobe stuff here. Got No Limit. We've got Pierce, we got a Magic Johnson. Uh, that Carter's nice. Some more Jordan stuff. Let's take a look at this Carter. This is one of the higher tiers. It's a nice looking card. So there we go, Vince Carter. It's a good little binder. Some Jordan stuff, gotta put that aside. Did I look at the other side? I did, there's Kobe. Yeah, I gotta put that one aside. Here's some gold label, um, just like the inserts they'd put in the packs. You know, I'm gonna show these though while I got it here. Um, kind of like a little sell sheet. Mm, maybe I'll show it if I don't rip it all to pieces. Paper loss, just like the cards. You can't even get an insert now, the checklist now. Um, so this this is actually helpful. So, what, you know, if, if we could only get this today, you look at it and you see, okay, so here's your different classes. You know, class one, class two, class three. Um, and, and you can look at the labels as well. So you have just the gold label, the black label, and the red label. There are so many variations of these. Um, and like, if you look here, actually Jake Roy and I were talking about this yesterday. There are all of these one 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 So there's different one on one So there's a lot for each player and really they don't surface. They do not surface. So, um, all right. So this is, this was a new standard, um, and new standard and, I guess I would identify that as the, I don't know what that would be. I can't see what type of label that would be. So this stuff's tough. Um, I'm still learning. If you're still learning, you know, <laughs> join with me because it's not easy. Here's a rookie card of Rip Hamilton. Um, Rick Smith's shadow card. I'm sure that card got blocked or that shot got blocked, I should say. I'm exhausted. I'm mixing up all my words here. Um, good stuff, Pierce. We got some star base. Not bad. These feel thick like they're... Looks like there's only two cards in there, I guess. Okay, we got a star power. Unfortunately, not the one of the higher tiers. We got a star power of Scotty Pippen. I'll leave it in for now. SI for kids, Scotty Pippen. I see that in there. There's a unlicensed Scotty Pippen. So we got Pippen. Some more Pippin. I'll leave this out because it's got the round ball royalty, the um, couple tops. Nothing spectacular. Um, yeah, so some more Pippin. Some more baseball. Not even going to focus too much on those. A Terrell Davis. Some Ray Allen press pass. Uh, Tim Duncan press pass. Nothing special here. We got a, a Cyclops Fleer Ultra X Men. Looking like Elvis Presley. Cyclops as the king. Set that aside. That's different. All right. Nothing spectacular here. Um, I think that's Billups rookie. Lakers starting five. Not worth a whole lot, but still a cool card. Wave of the future. Stoudemire. Not much here that I can see, just ovation base cards. Um, there's a Dion, Fleer Ultra. We got a Duncan, um, Star Quest. That's nice. Maybe get your inserts. All right, let's see what we got here. Looks like some Star Base on this side, and a Duncan insert Iverson I know this is just a base card but that stuff's gotten popular so I actually moved a couple of these earlier in the summer well I'll have to get them later that is not coming out of there limited access Ray Allen so that is one of them that folds up freshly forged Ray Allen that's pretty cool I'll, I'll put that page aside. I like that. Some ovation base. Uh, Marbury showcase. 
I mean, this is tough here, the Youthquake, but for Stackhouse, it's not really worth a whole lot. <laughs> I'm guessing the Iverson card that I knew about is going to be on the very last page. I always look at these Thunders closely. Look at the foil, and then you can look at the back, but look at the foil if you're looking at the front, because um, that'll tell you if it's one of the Raves or the Super Raves. The Grant Hill Stadium Club Chrome, some ovation base. Uh, all right, so here is the here's one of the pages that I saw. So we got a, a Penny Hardaway Key Ingredient Gold, not worth a lot, but cool. It's the gold parallel. We've got the Iverson New Edition, which is hopefully it's in pretty good condition. Yeah, so probably worth more than sixty in that condition. I'll have to look at the back. I might change my mind then, but probably worth more than 60 in that condition. Uh, Duncan Newcomers, not worth much. Penny Hardaway Bobble, Tower to Power. None of those are worth a ton on there. They're still cool cards, though. And some Ovation. And then we got a Garnett Rookie. And that's about it. Um, all right, so there you have it. I thought that was a, a pretty good lot for 120 I don't know if I'm going to... Uh, you know, well, I'm definitely not going to get rich off of that. If I probably piece all that out, well, remember there's all those Jordans in there. I'll probably do all right, at least break even, which is what I like to do. Because if I can open this and break even on the chance that there's something rare in there, I'm going to take that chance. I like unearthing rare stuff, um, rescuing rare stuff, right? So uh, anyway, if you if there's anything in there I missed, let me know in the comments. If there's anything in there that um, you know, stuck out to you, let me know in the comments. And otherwise, new episodes every Thursday. Thanks for watching, as always.